Court storm to sand storm. It's isn't about what's wrong with Kentucky. It's about what's right with South Carolina. $18,000 exclusion is getting at is sort of the interaction between the um, estate So you beat Kentucky, like crazy environment, super like an amazing experience. And like we celebrate a little bit as a team, um, nothing crazy. But that night, I still had some, I still had some homework to do. So as soon as I got home from the game, I was like, okay, let me, let me do a little bit of this homework. Then I could get together with the guys and celebrate a little bit. And then I was ready to go here at 9 a.m. Um, for my uh, criminal procedure. Right. Sometimes I feel like Hannah Montana <laughs> because it's like the best of both worlds. Back when I was uh, in, in, in Belgium, um, you know, I was always tall, so people tell me, oh, go play basketball, uh, try it out. And I uh, never did at first, uh, but eventually found my way into the game, started loving it. And um, as soon as I started playing, it was like, okay, at some point I want to go to America. I want to make it to the NBA, uh, but first I want to make it to college. I started getting into these conversations with people like, what, how do I maximize the opportunity? Um, should I go to law school? And most people were like, no, no, law school, that's, I don't think it'd be possible. So for a while, I kind of like put those plans on hold. And eventually I was like, man, who is really saying I can't do this? So did some more research and I found out about a guy who um, played at Seton Hall, did law school. And um, from there, I was like, man, there's, there's someone who did it. So who are you to tell me no? Coach Barrett set up a meeting with the dean here, um, allowed me to speak to some people. And um, I told them about my ID and they were like, well, if you can get in, if you, can, uh, if you apply, get in, uh, we'll give you a shot. It's crazy to be on a path that's not been like traveled before. A fan yesterday at the game was like, man, you gotta be like this guy, like just study and, um, like you'll make it far. Like those things are like very cool to hear. I would have to say thank you to so many people. It is crazy. Like from the dean to my professors, uh, to my classmates. Um, I mean, everybody is just, even the people in the cafeteria who are so nice to me blessing you with their smile or, or how you're doing uh, makes it makes a huge difference. I want this to be a total acknowledgement that like none of this is like really me doing things on my own strength. It is um, all Blessings going from the Lord and like from people surrounding me, um, helping. I came in not really to chase personal accolades at all. I mean, yes, I wanted to like be successful on the court, absolutely, but I really came in to like be a part of something bigger than me. I wanted to be part of a new chapter for South Carolina basketball, and like that's what's happening. Like what I'm doing is meaningful. If it means something, I can like inspire other people to like do something that they may not have expected themselves to be able to do.